गाइस दिस इज मालिंकी वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल वॉइस ऑफ मालिंकी टुडे वी विल टॉक अबाउट फोटो सिस्टम पीएस1 एंड पीएस2 एंड इफ यू आर न्यू इन माय चैनल प्लीज सब्सक्राइब माय चैनल एंड इफ यू लाइक माय वीडियो प्लीज डू लाइक कमेंट एंड शेयर माय वीडियो सो इन लीव्स मेसोफिल सेल्स आर द प्लेस वेयर फोटोसिंथेसिस ऑकर्स इन मेसोफिल सेल्स chloroplasts are present in the cytoplasm so this is the chloroplast in chloroplasts there are thylakoids which are sac like structures like that and they are stacked together in grana grana are found in stroma that is an aqua structure of chloroplast now photosynthesis occurs in two parts light reaction and dark reaction in the membrane of thylakoid light reaction occurs whereas in stroma dark reaction occurs thylakoid membrane is a lipid bilayer membrane just like the plasma membrane two photosystems ps1 and ps2 take part in light reaction they are placed in thylakoid membrane although ps2 works fast during photosynthesis but it is named 2 since ps2 was discovered later than ps1 the structures of ps2 and ps1 are almost same with a very little difference each of them contains light harvesting complex or lhc so two such lhc are found in each photosystem and a reaction center is found between two lhc in each lhc different types of pigments are present such as chlorophyll b which is green in color carotenoid which is orange in color and xanthophyll which is yellow in color these pigments are called accessory pigments or antenna pigments which are found in huge number in lhc in reaction center only two molecules of chlorophyll a are present which are bluish in color and here the difference comes between ps2 and ps1 in ps2 this chlorophyll a pair is called p680 who can absorb only 680 nanometer wavelength light in ps1 chlorophyll a pair is called p700 who can absorb only 700 nanometer wavelength light now antenna pigments absorb sunlight of different wavelengths here we need to remember one thing that plants absorb only 400 to 700 nanometer wavelength light to effectively perform photosynthesis and this region that is 400 to 700 nanometer wavelength is called photosynthetically active radiation or par par so here each pigment absorbs its respective wavelength light and one pigment absorbs light it gets excited and releases energy which is captured by the nearest pigment this pigment will then receive energy from the previous one and get excited and release energy in this way energy flow will occur in this lhc or light harvesting complex and ultimately this energy will be transferred to the reaction center in reaction center of each photosystem 
only two molecules of chlorophyll A are present. This chlorophyll A molecule will absorb the energy which is released by the last antenna pigment present in LHC and this pigment is present nearest to the chlorophyll A molecule. Chlorophyll A molecules will not only receive this energy but they will also absorb sunlight of a particular wavelength. For PS2 it is 680 nanometer and for PS1 it is 700 nanometer. So they will also get super excited and at this point they will not release energy but will lose electrons. So two electrons will be lost by two chlorophyll A molecules. These two electrons will be accepted by the primary electron acceptor which is pheophytin in case of PS2 and A0 in case of PS1. A0 is nothing but a modified chlorophyll. Now these primary electron acceptors will lose those two electrons and those two electrons will enter Z scheme of photosynthesis that is discussed in the previous lecture of photosynthesis lecture series.